Do you like the hair? <laughs> it um, it's oh, where are you? There you are. It's so hot today. I've literally had to like. I had a shower this morning and then I just put my headband on and scraped it all back. So I don't look glamorous at all today, but I really don't care because it's just so hot. I'm not even gonna bother straightening it because if I do, it's just gonna end up going wet again. And ugh. I've got my top on. Look, this is my charity shop bargain that I got and then I'm just wearing a little you can't see a little skirt that wasn't my pants that was the bottom of the skirt because my pants are blue um I'm very spotty so look at the nails look hang on I'm trying to the nails are very pretty I'll show you what they are let's go out here I'm trying to do more walking around vlogging because I've had a couple of you say that you miss me sitting on the sofa or walking to work and stuff. I did do some walking to work footage yesterday but um, I couldn't find my camera to put it on. So yeah, what did I use? I used this one by Avon which is called City Navy but I hate it. It's more, in the bottle it looks okay on camera but in real life it looks purple. But the consistency is awful. I really don't like it. So I topped it off with this. Which is a Barry M silver multi glitter. And it's so pretty. So that's what I have on my nails. Look at my rubbish garden. Look, it all needs weeding again. I only mowed this like four or five days ago. And it all needs mowing again. And I've got weeds. But it's just too hot. I really can't be bothered really cannot be bothered. I might do a bit later, who knows. Let's go for a walk. I sort of wanted to show you, because you, you've asked for a house tour, this is how long my living room is. It probably doesn't look that big. If I stand back here, this is my conservatory. You can perhaps see how long my living room is. Should we count how many feet it is? Ready? Start from the beginning. One, two, Three, this is really hard to do. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. <laughs> I'm going to go over 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. It's about, it's just under 31 foot, my living room. That's how long my living room is. Hello, baby. Emmy, are you hot? Emmy. Say hello. She's really hot, bless her. Yeah. So yeah, this is my living room. It's a bit um, messy because obviously I've got toys. But at the end of the day, I have a three-year-old. So. And then that's the hall. I have just done my housework, so it shouldn't be too bad. Apart from the clothes on the buggy. I'm so sorry about that. That's Mark. This is my hall. Going up the stairs. I really like the grey. I'm so glad I did the grey. Yes, babe. My key wrap. This is my front door. See? And then that's going upstairs. Now we're going into the kitchen because Amy wants me to go in the kitchen with it. Yes, babe. Let's just turn this off. Ugh. What do you want? Do you want some out of the cupboard? Yeah. We have to get some out of the cupboard. So I'm just going to go into the conservatory. The conservatory is quite big actually, but it's so hot in here at the moment. So that's my conservatory. More toys. Toys everywhere. And then obviously that's the garden. And then that's back in the living room again. So that's like a tour of the downstairs of my house. Um, I'm not going to show you upstairs because I haven't done upstairs yet. Plus, I don't really want to show my bedroom because bedrooms are quite private. 
Immy's room again, I don't really want to show, and um, my makeup room you've seen. So, I don't need to show you my makeup room. I'll just go back this way. Go back into the living room. I have no door. It's quite funny, I was supposed to have a door here, but the previous owners took it off. I think they like kicked a hole in it or something. So, do you know what I find really funny? Our main TV is the same size as Mark's PC TV. I think that's quite funny. Ben and Holly. So let's go over here and sit down and we'll do the daily challenge. I might sit and have a chat with you guys later, I don't know. I think I'm going to play on the PlayStation in a minute. I'm going to play... I think I'm going to play Disney Universe, I don't know. Oh, I can't stand it up this way. Hang on. I'm going to stand up the other way, that's mad. So... Uh, that's fine. What are we today with the 19th? Look how rubbish I look on camera. Oh, the hot weather does bad things to me. If you could live anywhere, where would it be and why? Hmm. What have I put? I think I put America. I'm just going to double check. Uh, 30 things. Yeah, America I've put. Now, I am i don't care about living in the UK. There are benefits to living in the UK. For instance, the UK has semi-free healthcare. Like, we can go to the doctors or we can go to the hospital and we don't have to pay for it. Like, if I had to take Immy to the doctors tomorrow, I wouldn't have to pay for it. If I went in and had a baby, I wouldn't have to pay for it. Whereas in America, healthcare is not free. Healthcare is very expensive in America. Um, so I am glad for that. I mean, we have to pay for prescriptions, obviously, but... What annoys me a bit about this country, though, is that certain places get free prescriptions, and where I live, we don't, and certain places get free water, and we don't, and it just... It annoys me. There's so much about this country that annoys me. I mean, I mentioned it briefly, like mainly to do with benefits and the government. And but you're going to get that wherever you live. Um, I would like to live in America purely for shops, just because the choice in America is so much different. Although I have been told that America doesn't have the same sort of chocolate as what we do, which is quite upsetting. The only American chocolate I've ever tried, like pure American chocolate, is um, Hershey's, and that was quite nice. I really enjoyed the Hershey's, so that was okay. I've never been to America in my life. I'd love to go. I would love to go to America. But again, I'm more from the touristy side. I want to go to Disneyland and Universal Studios. And I want to go to Florida and Miami. And I want to go shopping in New York. And, you know, I want to do all the touristy stuff. I'm not bothered about all the rest of it. I mean, there's a lot of people who want to go move to Canada. I'm not bothered about moving to Canada. I just, I don't know. I'd like to, I don't know. I'm not too fussed where I live. As long as I'm with Mark and Immy, I'm not really that bothered where I live. I mean, at the moment where I am, um, I've got my mum and dad close by, but that's not going to be forever, is it? I mean, I'm 26 years old. I'm nearly 27. I'm not going to spend the rest of my life here just because my mummy and daddy are here. So, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Um, I don't know. I look really wide today. Because <laughs> of that. Oh, I don't like it. I'm ugly today. Um, sorry, I'm not putting myself down. I'm just. Bleh. I get in trouble from you guys. You guys have all been telling me off, like stop putting yourself down and blah blah blah. I'm not doing it so that you give me compliments. It's just what I actually think of myself. I'm really sorry, guys. Look at the forehead. Look, I love doing the forehead test with people. If you, I was told that if you've got more than three fingers, you should not have your forehead out. Well, I have four. I have four and a bit on my forehead. Three is supposed to be the limit. I have a massive forehead. Look how big my forehead is in relation to the rest of my face. I have lots of forehead. I have a big face. <laughs> I've just got a big face. Needs more makeup. Like, I'll watch people who use the same foundation as me and they're like, oh, I only need one pump and there's me. Keep doing it because I've got so much face to cover. <laughs> but, um... I wanted to say thank you to you guys who have been messaging me and sort of making sure I'm okay and that. I'm not okay, but 
I'm coping. It's not really me who has to cope. I'm, I'm not, like I said, I'm not going into it. A couple of you do know, like a couple of you who I'm really, really close to, um, I have told you but that's it and that's only because I know that it's not going to go any further it's not like a big massive secret but it's not my it's not my issue to tell that's why I'm not telling it so um but yeah I wanted to say thank you for the the comments that I keep getting from you guys especially about the one about my nan that was I got a lot of nice comments from that one haven't had any agony aunt stuff yet though considering somebody said that I should do it I've not had anything in so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to um, I'm gonna still do the agony aunt thing, but I'm gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it on Monday. I'm gonna do it um, when I've got a few questions in. So it'll just be a random day. So if you do have anything that you want to ask me, like about not about myself, just about life in general, then um, like I said, feel free to leave it on any of my vlog comment video, any of my videos. I really don't mind. Or you can private message me. Um, if you're on Facebook, you can message me on Facebook, you can message me on Twitter. Um, there are different ways of getting in contact with me. Come follow me on Instagram as well. I'm on Instagram every single day. I'm obsessed with that website. Is it a website? It's more of an app, isn't it? So all my details are down below and all the different places that you can reach me if you ever feel like you want to talk to me. Twitter is probably my least used one, I will admit. I'm not a big Twitter fan. But I've got it. I had it because my previous phone that I had was um, supposed to be like a, a social networking phone. And it had Twitter built in. I couldn't delete it off. So I kind of just started using it. And I do like it, but I'm not a big... I'm still more of an update my Facebook status or put it on Instagram kind of girl. I'm not a Twitter girl. But I do go on it and I do talk to people on it. But um, if you want to reach me quickly, Facebook is probably your quickest one or YouTube, not Twitter. I will eventually get to it. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to have a chat with you all. What I might do for you is um, I'll insert the walking to work footage from yesterday. I'll insert it today if I can find my camera. I've put it somewhere. It's probably just in my bag. I think it is in my bag. Um, and I will put that in at the end of this one so obviously that's not from today that's from yesterday morning when I walked to work um, I know why I look big I've got no necklace on look because I'm hot I'm like scratching and it, ugh. I, ha I normally have necklaces on and I haven't got any and I feel naked without necklaces I'm a real necklace whore oh my god I love necklaces so much but it has to be big statement ones not little bleh. look at the hair look should we see how let's see how big we can make the hair are we ready? It's not going to be very big because my hair is very fine. There you go. I look like a... I don't know what I look like. <laughs> Everybody says they prefer me with long hair, which is cool, but my hair doesn't grow long. If I could have my own hair long, even though it's thin, I would still happily have it long because I could curl it or make it foofier. But my hair just doesn't... It kind of gets to about here and then it stops. I mean, I keep looking at my wedding photos, and I've got quite thick hair on there, which is cool. I've got a couple of, wed of wedding ideas, video ideas of what I want to do. I'm just going to tell you, and I want you to tell me what you think. Because they're videos that I've wanted to do for a while. So, I'm going to do an updated weight video, but I'm going to wait for a bit on that one, just purely because I have been cheating. Um, so, I want to wait until I'm fully back on it and started losing weight again and then I'm going to do an updated weight video. I've got loads and loads of videos. I could even do it now because I've got loads of photos, not videos, um, starting right back when I was 20, going all the way up to where I am now and it's all different photos showing you how big I've got and that sort of thing. So I want to do that video. Um, I was going to do a hair video as well, um, like my hair story, but a lot of my hairstyles I don't have photos of, which is annoying. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to do that one yet or not. I have had many, many hairstyles, so we'll see. Um, I do want to do a pregnancy and birth video, just talking all about how my pregnancy was, what I experienced, what birth was like afterwards, all that sort of thing. Um, I also want to do an Imogen video, but I don't know how many people will find that interesting. But that's basically going to be... Um, 
photos and video clips of Immy as she's grown up. So if anybody does want to see that, I'm going to make one anyway for myself, like for personal reason. Not personal reason, it's just for a personal thing. Um, but if anybody would like to see that and see Immy growing up, then let me know and I will put it on. Um, and the other thing that I want to do is a wedding one, uh, which will show my wedding photos. I do have my wedding video I've got a DVD of my wedding as well that my aunt did for me so if I'm able to extract that onto the computer then I will do and then I can put clips from my wedding in as well which would be quite cool I hate my wedding I hate the way I look on my wedding but I will do it anyway um, and my last one is a guru's rant now that's more of the quite a lot of people are doing these now shit that beauty gurus say and it's quite funny but um, I'm kind of playing with that one I don't know if I'm going to do that one or not just because I watch Vad is Rad and she um, she does really good ones, it's really funny. But um, yes, yeah, so there's a few video ideas that I am thinking of doing that I do really want to show you. I really want to do this weight video now because I'm just looking at photos of myself and I'm just like, look how big I was. And I know that you guys won't think I was that big, but to me I was. To me I was massive. I'm trying to find a bad one. Look, this is a bad one. That was, I think that was last year. Look how bad I am, look how big I am. And I know there'll be people out there, oh, you don't look big, you look lovely. But to me, that that is quite big. That was, oh, that's when I was 25, so that was like nearly two years ago. Um, I do have a, I'm just having a look to see what I've got. I have this one which is quite cool. This is from when I started my um, weight loss to not long ago. So I'll just pre-warn you, the first photo I am just in my bra and um, some leggings. But it's when I first started my weight loss journey and then the photo next to it is what I'm at now. So, look, that's how far I've come. I'm still big, I've still got a lot of work to do, but I think compared to the first photo, I've done really well. I'm not trying to blow my own trumpet, but you can kind of see how far I've come. <laughs> this is why I get annoyed on like, when I do my new haul videos with me modeling the clothes or when I do outfits of the day, I think I look massive and it's really annoying because it's not, conveying across how much weight I've lost because like I'll look at it and I'll probably wear a size 18 top but it looks like I'm lying and I'm not I can show you the tags the tags say 18s and it's just annoying so but yeah that's how far I've come I'm gonna sneeze oh oh thank you baby oh excuse me look I'm all boobs today I'm trying to keep them covered and they keep jumping out um i really want to find my wedding dvd now so that i can perhaps do a wedding video for you guys i think that'd be quite cool and then you can all share my wedding day Woo! so um yeah let me know if you want to see any of those let me know what you think um i look like a tee tee yeah let me know what you think I don't really have anything to say now apart from that it's hot I don't like being hot and look how shiny I am what I don't understand is people who wear long sleeves when it's hot I really don't understand it I don't understand it at all you see people walking about and they've got a coat on or they've got a fleece on and I'm just like are you not human are you actually not human that you feel the need to wear a fleece when it's 32 degrees outside? I'm like, oh dear. Okay, I'm going to stop because I just need to. Let's just have a quick look on Facebook. See if anything's happening on Facebook. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to see... What is going on? What on earth is that? Um, 
there isn't really that much going on. going on on Facebook so thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed today's vlog let me know what you think about those video ideas and I will definitely start pursuing some of them um, yeah so let me know what you guys think and I will see you all tomorrow bye guys so I was just outside enjoying the sun Amy was in the swing and now can you hear it's just started raining look I don't know if you can see it. I feel like a drop on my head. I felt a couple of drops and at first I actually thought I'd been pooped on. I am wearing a top just so you can see. I thought I'd been pooped on and I hadn't and it was the rain. I was like, oh. But I was trying to top up my tan because look, I've got a bit on my back but I've got lines. So I was hoping to... Um, get rid of the lines but that's not going to happen now so yeah <gasps> you're doing <really> well <sighs> so yeah we had to come in because it's raining need some fine flour I need 180 grams of it so let's see I really like baking for me I mean, obviously I'm going to eat some of this stuff because it's stupid not to, but um, I'm mainly doing this for Emmy. So I'm now adding the flour a bit at a time, but I'm sieving it because it helps. If you do bake it and you sometimes find that when you're making cakes you get lumps, sieve your flour in. I know that a lot of people do anyway, but... I never used to, I just used to chuck it all in and then later on I sort of thought, hang on, if I sieve it, it'll get rid of some of the lumps for me. Amy, what are you doing with them cutters? This is what I made. I made shortbread biscuits with chocolate drops in them. I can't remember what they're called and then I just made fairy cakes with um, chocolate drops in them and then on top of the fairy cakes I'm gonna put Betty Crocker but I'm letting them all cool so I've been busy bee I might put a chocolate button on top of the cake I'm what not too sure what the biscuits look like and then this is what everything looks like now the cakes have got chocolate on and buttons and they're all done